Hi. Hi. <laughs> I was expecting this big, huge, good morning, everybody. And then we got, hi, guys. Hi. <laughs> Welcome to a brand new Toby day. <laughs> Welcome to a brand new day. We are just starting a homeschool today. We're a little late because it's like nine. Yeah, it's nine. Oh gosh, I hate it. I find it so much easier to sleep in in the country. Living in the country is so peaceful and so much better. You find it easier to sleep in? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. yeah like one day I never wanted to get up because because the city yeah. is full of noises. Yeah. And we're in the country. Yeah. Peaceful. Yeah. Winds are chirping. Winds oh. are not chirping ever. <laughs> <laughs> it's winter. Oh, she always cracks me up. She's like, in the in the country, it's so peaceful. I should just replay that clip. But basically, she said, it's so peaceful in the country. All the birds are chirping, but they're not chirping ever because it's winter. Oh gosh, I love when I love that. That's so hilarious. one day in winter, they are chirping though. Yeah, I'm sure they were. I'm a little scared to go outside. Why? Because there's saw tracks. Tracks? Yeah, upstairs outside of your window I saw tracks in the snow. What kind of tracks? I don't know. Like people tracks? It might be dad's tracks, I don't know. Dad's feet tracks or his truck tracks? Feet tracks. I don't know what tracks are. Okay. Those are mine! Because when I was down there, Dad was driving up in the truck and I had Ruby. So Yesterday. Yeah, no. Gabby was down there last night. Like, they look fresh. Fresh. Fresh tracks. You guys, we're going to go up there and we're going to explore later, aren't we? Anyway, welcome to today. We are getting started with homeschool. First on the agenda is Serafina in the Twisted Staff. Comment below if you guys have read this book. We are on page 165. And it's a really good book. We are loving it. Getting the school day done fast since we didn't do school at all yesterday. Yeah, we're doing. But I had to help dad and it was freezing, so. I had to look things. Poor Gabby. So we had to do my chores, but I don't care. Two, like, doing my chores and her chores together are better than helping dad. Even though we did get ice caps. Anyway, so many things going on, and I don't know how to share them with you guys. Like, so many things are happening, and you know how, like, I just never want to offend people. I don't want to hurt people's feelings, and it's at that point where I have to be careful what I say because it could, it, it could affect other people, and it's really hard when you come into a situation like that. Like, sometimes it seems like no matter what I say, people find fault with it. I get so. Oh, I forgot to watch the vlog this morning. Do you watch our vlogs? Only when they're good, not the crappy ones. <laughs> Out of the mouths of babes. Only when it's me riding and jumping, then I watch it. And she's riding and she's jumping. Or if my horse is acting crazy in the field, like he was. Anyway, we are headed to the barn today. Um, this is going to be a lot about Stella. Stella is. Stella is, uh, I'm so worried you guys, I'm so worried about Stella. Um, yeah, is, uh, I really am super worried about her. Uh, we're gonna head to the barn today and do some stuff with her and um, she, yeah, we have a vet appointment. Monday. We have a vet appointment on Monday, so that is coming up, but yeah. Okay, that's enough with the intro. Let's get on with the vlog. Look who's here, you guys. Gabby talked me into bringing Ruby. I slid getting into the car, just like, you know, like split, slid. Oh, it hurts my tailbone. It hurt my tailbone. I broke my tailbone. It's one of the last bones to heal. It hurts. What? Okay. Give her to me. Give her to me. Step away from the food, Stella. Watching storm over there. <laughs> All right, something's going on in the field. Storm's taking off from Gabby. Can you guys see? The closer she gets, the farther he walks. Poor, poor Gabby. Uh, 
And now he's caught. He's like, fine. from trying to get up in her stall. So we're gonna clean that up, get her some bedding. This one doesn't look too bad. You wanna do it, Sophie? Sophie? I'm good. Can you go get that cream? Okay, so there's that one. this little brush and she's got this one that I showed you guys the other day and it looks like it's healing really well it's hard to see I know I'm sorry sweet girls oh. okay I'm gonna dry it off it's okay then we're gonna put the cream on okay we got some antibiotic cream we're gonna put that on all right, you guys, question of the day, comment below. What is this horse? What, who ha is this horse that Sophie has nicknamed? And what is the nickname? Mm -hmm. Ooh. Sophie. They probably all know you still. So this used to be, she used to be in Stella's Field and Sophie nicknamed her something. Comment below what the nickname is. Uh, you guys could guess the name of this horse. She looks totally different in here. Um, and her owner, the, we're gonna reveal her owner. All right, we're gonna tell you guys what Sophie nicknamed this horse. What's her name? Meanie. Meanie, <laughs> but that's not your name, is it? And you're not a mean horse. You just make mean faces. Yeah, and this All is her time. owner. You guys might not know Zoe, but Zoe rides Stella for us sometimes and is amazing. I know we've had a lot of good comments about Zoe. And this is her horse, and her name is not Meanie. What's her name? Kada. Kada, well, that's a cute name. So Gabby's uh, switching Storm's coat because it's gonna be warm the next couple of days. The freeze is over and he's gonna get his medium weight coat on. All right, there we go. Where? I thought Stella was gonna roll. Stella just changed her ears. You guys. I did it, we're leaving the bar now. I know I didn't vlog very much because you get busy doing stuff and then other people there, you get talking and stuff and I gave Stella's last month's notice and oh, it was nerve wracking, like I was worried because- Why not Storms? Yeah, Gabby wants Storm to come home now too. Yeah, like, he's coming home and Stella's coming home. You want them both home? Yeah, they're coming home this weekend. Yeah, like so many things happening and going on. I'm gonna share with you guys soon, but first we need to move our horses and... <sighs> Mom was literally about to cry was, she was talking to the... I'm so literally about to cry. Like, I want our horses with us so badly and I know that there's stuff that has to be done to them, especially Stella, that only I can do, only we Ooh, can do. Me. But I'm, I'm still nervous and I'm afraid and... And not any more than I would be with any other change in my life. That's just who I am. I know we can do it. We have our two trainers. They're going to support us and help us. It's just scary, you guys. Like, it's done, though. Like, Stella's coming home. All right, guys. So, Ruby here. She's panting really hard right now because we got to let her off the leash at the tax store. And, you know, Holly, the one who tried to spy on me? when I was getting changed. Um, trying on breeches. Um, yeah, Ruby's first ever best friend, or first ever friend. How do you feel about that, Ruby? Oh yeah, Ruby, Ruby was wagging her tail, chasing after her and barking. 
barking her head off. And then after, she went to hide between me and Dad. Yeah! So, now she has a friend and she loves her friend. Right, Ruby? She's like, I just need to rest right now. It's like, I just need a nap. She was running around a lot though, like a lot. Oh yeah. Okay, so we're home and I've been trying to shoot this little bit of our video yeah, for 10 minutes. But anyway, um, I haven't really said everything that's happening with Stella and there will be more in another video. I'm just really worried about her. Her weight is ballooned. Um, uh, she's not moving very well. I, I just feel like I need to, br I just, you know how you just feel it? Like I've been feeling uh, for a month now, I've been feeling like I need to get her home. I need to get her here and... Plus, we were always going to move them home. Like. Yeah. Oh, track. So, track. yeah, Gabby is like, we're, we're getting stuff ready. Like, we just went to the store to get all of our mats. Um, you guys, we're just ready. Like, I'm just, I just feel like I need to get her home and help her to lose weight. And I know some of you guys are thinking that we're the treat family, but I can, I can make my girl lose weight. Okay, come here. It's not too bad. Okay, so, please, I did the splits earlier. So, show me the tracks that you saw today. These tracks. Oh, that does look like a bunny track but they're huge those are bunny tracks Mom. Maybe yeah like or squirrels i don't want to give it to that yep i see a look and they went all the way across the driveway oh those ones are a little smaller they came from up there no look they come all the way over here we're tracking bunnies you guys we are out here at dusk at our house it's actually kind of nice it's supposed to be a nice starting tomorrow like in the pluses ruby it makes me nervous her going near the don't take ruby near there anyway we're waiting outside our house because fiona is on her way here we're going to show her everything and she's going to tell us what we need to do and then yeah <sighs> nervous This is our run at night, you guys. This is what it's gonna be like when we come down here in the night to do chores. This is what it's gonna be like, Gabby. And don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.